Welcome to another edition of IMO Sports with Pedro Justice. Guess what? Canelo Saul Alvarez is a free agent. I repeat, Canelo Alvarez is now a free agent, free from the zone, free from Golden Boy Promotions. Uh oh. In my role as a manager and coach of Saul, Canelo Alvarez. I allow myself to communicate to the boxing community and to all of our fans that starting today, November the 6th, Canelo becomes a free agent. So we are ready to continue with his boxing career. All this time, we have been working very hard in the gym with a lot of responsibility and discipline to be in great physical shape and ready to fight this year. And it will be. We will announce date, rival, and place very soon, and we will return stronger than ever to keep growing and showing that Mexican boxing is the best. Thank you, Eddie Renoso. <laughs> Uh-oh. What's going on, Golden Boy? Uh-oh. What's going on? Now, as you remember... There was a lawsuit filed against the zone and Golden Boy Promotions and Oscar De La Hoya where Canelo felt that it was under the wrong terms, that he was not getting what he was promised. And basically, they weren't paying him the money they promised. And so because they were not paying him the money he was promised, he did not like that. And so you remember this picture? Hey, Canelo, oh, it's golden boy, Oscar de la Haya, Oscar de la Haya. <laughs> Oscar, what happened? What happened, my friend? Why doesn't Canelo look happy anymore? Canelo trusted you, and now he feels that you dropped the ball because you didn't hold his own responsible for the contract. He wanted his $350 million. He wanted his mucho dinero and you did not deliver according to Canelo and Team Canelo so what does that mean that means he's taking you to court first time he had a little situation had a little issue it was dismissed so when they dismissed it people are like uh oh what's going to happen is Canelo going to get out of this and all of a sudden he refiled the correct way and now he is a free agent. And what does that mean for the boxing world? That means that any promotional company, any promoter has the opportunity to more than likely partner up with Canelo because at 30, he wants to take full control of his career. I don't see him trying to give over complete control to anyone. I think it would be a deal where he would want to partner up with someone, but definitely not give complete control of anything to anyone. I mean, is Oscar going to be crying right now? You know how TMZ likes to do it. They like to make a show of things. <laughs> and so it's looking as though Canelo and Team Canelo wants to fight this year and it's already november so the only month left is december and as reported here canelo alvarez is reportedly targeting a possible fight with versus ibf super middleweight world champion caleb plant on december the 19th after announcing that he is now a free agent as you remember that was a date that tyson fury and deontay Wilder were supposed to fight so if that happens does that mean that Canelo could possibly fight in partnership with PBC? I don't think Eddie Hearn is in the running because of the zone ties. I think Canelo wants to get completely free. But it's interesting that they mentioned Caleb Plant, PBC. Caleb Plant, PBC. Canelo Alvarez, PBC. Do you believe it? Could it be so? Now, as we know, Caleb Plant has been training. He looks in great shape. He's always in great shape. He takes boxing very seriously. And Caleb Plant doesn't play around. In his last fight, in his other fights, he did what he had to do earlier this year and last year. So Caleb Plant is definitely a viable opponent. 
do you believe that he should fight Caleb Plant next? Or do you feel that he should fight someone else? What are your thoughts on him being a free agent? Do you believe that Oscar De La Hoya and the zone will try to find, file a counter suit? There's a lot going on right now. It's a very exciting time in boxing. And for the Canelo fans, you're going to get Canelo Alvarez one more time. That means more Canelo, more punching, more beating up on someone. Or if he faces Caleb Plant, can Caleb Plant go in there and shock the world? Because you know Canelo's going to be the favorite, but Caleb Plant has that something inside of him where he's not going to back down. I would love to see that fight. Let me know what you think until next time. It's Pedro Justice.